Hey there, you awesome human being. My name is Sean Resnick and I'm a naturopath, hypnotherapist and mindset coach and welcome to yet another edition of Life and Flow, the segment that's all about how to find the gold that occurs to you in life and to take away the nuggets that help you realize that life happens for you. It's not happening to you, which means that every opportunity, everything that happens to you in your life has potential for you to grow from and also, you know, help to realize that when you hold on to the negative, it weighs you down and it prevents you from experiencing life to the full. So just a very quick uh, little thing. This is why I'm a little wet and soaked at the moment. It's because I decided to go for a walk with my dad this afternoon. I absolutely love the man. He's one of my favorite people in the world. And we were going to go for a long walk with the dogs and I was really looking forward to it. The moment we left the house, the heavens opened up and it started pouring with rain. Now, maybe there was a time in our lives where we both would have gotten upset, or like, ah, I wanted to go for this walk, lost opportunity, but instead we found a tree. And under this tree we stood with the two dogs, and my dad and I just chatted about life, and about, you know, the week that was, and uh, stuff that's going on in their world, my mum and dad's world, and stuff that's going on in mine, and we just got to connect and share on a beautiful level, as, as we always do. But instead of focusing on how cold it was or that we're getting wet, we decided to instead focus on the opportunity we now had to stand still and to just be and to chat and to learn from each other. And more importantly, more than any of that, <laughs> to laugh with each other. My dad and I have a very special bond and one of the things that really connects us is our ability to find the humor in stuff. So we're always coming up with these funny little anecdotal stories and you know, um, little things that make us both laugh, okay, like little school kids. And it always makes me think the time spent with dad is just such a joy, okay? So today what I want to talk to you about specifically is the choice we make on what we focus on, okay? Do we choose to focus on the cold, wet rain that's kind of wrecking an opportunity to get out and exercise and to go for take the dogs for a walk? Or do we instead focus on the opportunity that the rain presents, which is to just be still in nature, listening to the sounds around us and still making light of an otherwise very wet, <laughs> uh, soggy sort of situation. So in life it is a choice, we do get to choose what we focus on and depending on what you focus on will impact your life greatly. Um, so when you focus on certain things, if you're focusing on the negative, you're going to make it mean that nothing good happens and most likely you'll feel like you're in the dumps and the world happens against you, everything happens against you. Whereas if you choose to focus on what the silver lining is, what the lesson is in that circumstance, God, there's so many opportunities for growth, you know. And in those circumstances, then you can start moving forward and finding a way out of the glum hole that you might find yourself in and find the strength to see, what, find out what the lesson was in the first place. And there always is, no matter what happens in life. And we're all going to experience some kind of pain, some kind of trauma at some point. No one's immune from it. It's just called life, okay. And as much as we all experience these things, we've got to recognize that once we've experienced the pain and the trauma and we've been through what we've been through, and obviously don't deny yourself those feelings and that experience, like really feel it, there has to come a time when you make a decision to start focusing on what you do have, the positives, and even the future as well, and to take away the lessons from it so that you can become even more resourceful, okay? So, Dad and I, <laughs> decided, okay, you know, after about 45 minutes in the rain, it was getting a little bit cold and wet. So we decided to uh, run back to his respective house and mine. And, um, and here we are. <laughs> and I decided to do this video right now because I thought the inspiration from that met moment meant I could share with you a really beautiful experience that I've had today. And I want you to look deeply in your life at the moment. What can you start focusing on? What meaning can you give it? And what actions can you take to start implementing some of the lessons that you are learning? Because we're all here to learn, to give, to grow, and to experience life in its entirety, both the good and the bad, and all the positives and the negative. And we're here to actually find and forge our way 
forward in this awesome adventure called life. So I hope that's been a bit inspirational. I hope you've enjoyed uh, listening and I can't wait to present another edition of Life and Flow in a couple of weeks. Have a beautiful afternoon. Cheers. Mm-hmm.